Hi, this is John Campus, founder and CEO of Empus. I'm sure most of you are using or have at least heard of LinkedIn. You might even be watching this video on the platform now. LinkedIn is a social network that focuses on professional networking and career development. With over 600 million members, it has become the go-to social media platform for working professionals. But as a result of its popularity and detailed member profiles, it has also become a popular destination for hackers to launch attacks. This isn't just a LinkedIn problem though, this is an ongoing battle for all social media platforms. Although LinkedIn is doing a lot to keep the platform safe for its users, it's still relatively simple to create fake profiles. This is a problem because fake profiles created by bad actors can be used to impersonate people in your network that you trust. By impersonating these individuals, the bad actors can solicit important information from you like your company, professional contacts, work history, and even education. As you can imagine, this could have some serious consequences. Picture a bad actor acting as you, communicating with colleagues and others in your professional network. If gone undetected for some time, they could establish a level of rapport that could expose personal information about you or even them. This information could then be used for malicious purposes. There are some obvious indicators to help you spot a fake account. Things like fake profile photos, limited connections, usually under 50 or 100, poor spelling and grammar, lack of engagement, and finally suspicious offers by recruiters or businesses can all be indicators of a fake social media account. Additionally, here are some steps that you can take today to help mitigate the growing threat of social engineering attacks. First, access your privacy settings and make sure you understand all of the options. Modify them as necessary to make sure your account is secure. Second, search LinkedIn periodically for your name. If you see another account that isn't you, use the report block feature to file a report. Third, think twice about what you post on your profile. This information can be used to launch a social engineering attack. Lastly, before accepting or sending an invitation, search LinkedIn to see if there are duplicate profiles for that person. Make sure you remind yourself of the indicators of spot a fake account. I recommend you head over to LinkedIn and any other social media platforms you may use and start applying these steps today. Thank you.